What's up, everybody? Croc342 with another video. Hope everything's good. Gotta format some stuff. Okay. Back in Euro Truck. Doing a special transport. This is the load right here. So, we already went through the pre trips and whatnot. So, we're gonna go on ahead and just get this. Get this Get rolling. Try to move up a little bit. I think I gotta adjust myself. See how this track the hard actually President works. Wazer. The world awaits your commands. Got my buddy. Uh, um, Morgan Freeman actually helping us out. Turn wheels. Turn we're on the wrong side of the road, also. For those that may not know what this is all about, but in certain areas, keep right. Drive on the and then left turn side right. of the road. It's considered the right side, and some turn right. Some are eyesight. get a chance to ride on the actual European side but works for me This runs about six hours, unfortunately. So, let's see what we can do with it. I don't know when 137 will hit uh, Euro Truck, but I guess once uh, it's in full swing in ATS, then it'll probably move it on more likely. They've been working on any other projects. So, but I know they got a couple other little tidbits to come up. Uh, so, we got the Liberia, I think that's what it is. I mean, I Iberia. Iberia, something like that. I don't know why I said library, it's not the beginning of the eye. <laughs> and I tried to 
hit the screens the way I wanted to, but for some reason I couldn't get the track R, not the track R, the OBS, OBS the format right, so it's looking kind of sloppy. We already up on the wheel already, so. But, um, got the track R up and running, so. My screens may go out because there's no power going to them. Well, the capturing is going to them, so. Make sure we stay in our lane. Now we we'll always love the triple monitors, but uh, it's not for some reason OBS friendly sometimes. So. I think I must, uh, I just came across another mod pack. Um, it allows us to, um, sort of like a heavy haul thing. But it's, uh, it's, it doesn't, I think, uh, I forgot the, it's on the Steam Workshop where uh, a lot of the trucks there were uh, just 6x4. Speed trap ahead. 6x6. Six six, 4x4. Four mainly they're strictly for. A special transport like this truck right here even though it's a, a scan that comes with the 8x4 chassis this one is technically an 8x8 it may look like it's 8x4 but speed trap ahead is supposed to be let's play this safe so. so I stumbled across that and I think the the modder was able to create some other mods I mean some other trailers all he did was actually um, made him heavier. I'll probably be trying those later on. I don't know when. Gotta stay behind him. Can't make can't make a mistake and go not behind him. Yeah, cancel the run. And we have to sort of start all over. Keep left. And then I gotta check out straight. see why the Volvo, because every for some reason the Volvo I had a Volvo continue straight. That actually had the chassis set up, but the thing about it is, well, it was eight by eight, but I'd have been comfortable with the eight by four setup, so I had to take it out. And plus, I got the heavy, uh, the big, big pack for uh, from. Uh, Three nine. So. Just trying to figure out, figure out some stuff, you know. I was doing a heavy haul transport for uh, um, ATS and leaving sort of leaving ETS on the back burner. I know that some that may not be uh, game to really see that content. Plus, I'm also 
on my Facebook gaming page. Somebody had changed my name and whatnot, so I got to get some things together on that. I don't know what that was. I've seen other people that actually had the same issue, but I don't even think they really paid attention. So, And I've seen some didn't have no problem at all. So evidently, somehow, somebody been nitpicking in my business. So but I don't have time to be starting over. Got too far to go. So I try to do the best I can to kind of minimize issues on my page because I wasn't expecting anybody to pick on little me <laughs> but like I said they don't care you can be a big a little whatever it don't matter so, um, but just don't understand that um, you try it try yourself bringing attention to me you don't know what you're getting into If I find out who it is, it will be some legal technicalities and I will be prosecuting to the fullest extent of the law, regardless of if it's overseas or whatever it is. Whoever was my hacker decided to call in and call himself a bit different in my business. So, just to forewarn you, whoever it is. Speed trap ahead. Let's play this safe. So we got four hours and forty nine minutes on the run. Just having copyright issues would be a more pro more of a problem than trolls, but it's always a troll that wants to call yourself trying to and then at least they could have spelt Facebook right. They spelt it wrong. So I knew that it had to be somebody that you know didn't know what the heck they was doing, just dipping in something. They had no business dipping in, but the thing about it is you can't do that kind of stuff nowadays because now you get the federal folks that don't mind catching up with you when you're doing that kind of stuff and after a while you'll be caught you know that's just the way it goes you know it's just a good thing that I don't really have money attached to this, this page but I do have followers and my support and a lot of my stuff that I already had put in place so I don't have time to be starting over like that so the only reason why but I will be changing my name back so you know so yeah so just letting you know Screens and went down. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, can you close that door for me? Thank you. Yeah. yeah, so I'm just trying to relax. I got some work to do on vehicles and I want to 
want to get that done as soon as possible. We had a lot of rain. I, I heard that it was, a, I don't know if, well, this is, could be for those that are in the States as well as anywhere else. As when you deal with uh, the weather, it can be anywhere. So I heard in Arkansas, was a tornado. And I think that's why we had got a lot of rain in Ohio. So uh, a lot of rain. We might have got a, a touch of a tornado. I know it was thunderstorming real bad and it just the rain just kept coming down so got to get that for y'all all right this is a 60 ton load which is an industrial condenser so this is probably about the highest heaviest I've ever pulled in game uh, this isn't I don't think this is the heaviest heaviest but it's close it's close enough so and I think I got the toughest motor I could get in the Scania. I don't know if this is the S series or the R series. I think I forgot because there's two types that I was able to get uh, that had heavy haul capabilities. One thing I can respect with the European uh, side of, of the game, um, I don't mind actually. Uh, branching out to to have special um, vehicles for for the move what they need to move so I respect a lot that shows a lot of respect It'd be nice if the American market would really wake up and see uh, the value of that <clears throat> you know, more so than what they are uh, trader damage I must have got too close to those things over there I can't really see on that side but that's why I was using the monitors but it doesn't matter just trying to get through the run I to risk doing that in the real world but Sooner or later, this video will be uploaded. I have a few other videos that need to be uploaded, but I can't upload them on Facebook right now because of the situation that I'm dealing with right now. And um, this will probably be the last video. It won't be the last video, but it's one of the videos that I've um, have ran so far. And I'm just posting them on YouTube for now until uh, so those that are know me and you know who I am on, on YouTube also but I don't really do a lot of streaming like I used to I, I do uploading and I do a uh, premiere uh, when I can so if you want to see a lot of my content then you know you don't have the necessary wait do it on wait until I come back online I did share uh, one little article based on the game best based on uh, Colorado coming out because Colorado is around the corner uh, right behind uh, Idaho so and sooner or later just like I said there will be uh, uh, SUS will be releasing whatever map for this market right here 
in regards of the ETS-2 or better known as um, Euro Truck Simulator 2. So, yeah, more likely Speed they're going to be paid Let's DLCs. More likely because Speed Trap ahead. Let's play but the updates safe. normally are, and normally the trucks are are, in, are free. So, at least we get that much out the deal. Maybe a little bit more work in regards of getting the maps out or doing the maps. So they got to get something out the deal. If nothing else. So I can't expect everything to be free because you still got to gotta conduct business. You still got to pay your employees. You know, now the employees are at home because of the epidemic. So... Um, so that you know they're able to still luckily they're able to still do what they need to do uh, to continue you uh, do business as usual I came across a few little hiccups within my day um, went to work just to pick up some stuff that was in my locker just in case might not to, might not go back. I mean, I'll be going trying to go back, but just in case they decide to make the initiative of saying, "Well, he's not coming back," we're gonna change things around. So, <clears throat> got the last of my stuff that I was there. Still left a shirt Continue and uh, hat there because that was part of their uniform that they be trying to get money out of me for. And we'll see. We'll see how things pan out. As the days go on, because I'm, I'm sure everyone else is dealing with the same situation, they have to kind of play the days, days, where they can. I know uh, found out a, um, a truck dealership, U.S. truck dealership had to, uh, they had to cut their uh, people, their Keep workers, right. workforce. Continue straight. And um, they was they had at least two thousand employees, and they had to. Downgrade to 500. Then when they when the pandemic Continue came down, straight down, and they and end up at 107 employees. So you know went to the bank to go and make a deposit because one of the banks actually opened up on Sundays because of a um, because of it being a, in a supermarket. They even had to downgrade their times. So I had to catch them tomorrow at 9:30 to to do. To get that business together, so I'm, I'll be a day behind trying to get business together. So it is what it is. So. <laughs> yeah. Got things to do to the vehicles, but I figure I'm not gonna do it today. Probably make provision to do it tomorrow. I suppose they did it the uh, day before yesterday didn't get Keep that right. get it done because and it then, technically rained straight. all day Friday, Saturday it technically rained Friday Saturday continued straight and it actually finally stopped Sunday so yeah so we got two hours fifty minutes on this run Hopefully I'm not boring everybody too much. I mean, I'm try to do the best I can to share as much as much as I can. But I don't know. Maybe I'm not doing enough. I don't know. Um, I'm not doing enough. So um, do the best I can. Try to communicate as much as I can because I've even streamed. And didn't say anything and just kept it cordial. Now I'm trying to do more commentary and then pretty much the same views. I don't know. You know, you, if you don't communicate, I was told that I was doing good, which was fine. Then I start. I mean, started wanted to it inspire me to do more. But if I don't get any views, I mean, I can't just be up here just doing this stuff and not really benefit. I'm already doing free labor. Because uh, uh, the folks that are ahead of this thing 
are not allowing us, to, allowing the creators to do more. They really technically at their um, mercy because they hold the hold the cards. You know, and I mean, who who wants to continue to do free labor? Nobody. Who wants to continue to do? I mean, or have to go out of their character just to just to make a buck? You know. used to be a lot of dignity in the world now people do what it takes whatever it takes and degrade themselves to the best I mean to the worst to their worst estate just for a buck you know and it's sad but I don't know speed trap ahead let's play this safe never want to get to that point where you're desperate you know for that dollar, we understand we all got to work and we got to pay our dues and things of that nature. But you know, we should never have to degrade ourselves below. I mean, at a, at a point where we lose our self-respect, self, uh, self-esteem, and things of that nature. that's what actually pushed me to go to another uh, platform because of the current, I mean not the current situation but uh, prior situations but I didn't want to leave my 300 plus uh, subs you know behind you know so and it's up to y'all to really uh, make, give, take this thing to the you know, by the horns. I mean, I can do the best I can. And I can give do the, as many videos and, and stream as much as the person would think I should do it. But I have life to live, you know. And I'm refuse to put life on the, on, the, on, the, play this on the back burner just for to stream for something that I don't even see. <laughs> I mean, just you know, it's not, I'm not putting a paycheck in my pocket right now. It's not paying the bills right now. It's not even, even it's not even giving me a bite to eat. So, you know, and I've gotten even to the point, even with these jobs nowadays, it, it's worthless. You know, it's they want you to work. They want you to work harder. You know, they call themselves saying, "Oh, well, we at your best interest," but they pay you pennies. They don't. They don't want to pay you. They want you to work. Continue straight. To you, to you, to you fall out, or to you, to you break down, or you bust yourself up, and you can't, you can't uh, enjoy your enjoy your, your labor, which is bad. Yeah, you know, and then you're in the same breath, then you want to, uh, you know, it's like. Uh, job I was talking about not too long ago. No communication. You know, they want you to work, or you. They want you to figure it all out. They put the paperwork there, and you just read and figure it all out yourself. You just, I mean, you just hear, you figure it out. They don't. I mean, unions used to be a thing. Now the unions ain't worth nothing. Uh, Jobs ain't worth nothing. Speed trap ahead. You used Let's to retire. Now you can't retire off in anything. It's just Speed trap in a bad shape. Let's play this safe. In a bad, bad predicament. And then they wonder why people are on public assistance. You won't even give them an opportunity to get out of public assistance because you don't want to pay them. You won't. You think ten dollars? You think five dollars? Five dollars? Six dollars? Seven dollars an hour, eight nine nine dollars an hour is going to be able to help it help somebody. No, it's not going to help anybody. You're going to keep them down with your foot on their neck. You know that's all you're going to do. And then you give a person a hard time when they come to work, when they put their heart in, in, in the, when they get the job, they got a hard time because you got to go. All these, do all these, uh, prove yourself. You know, never could understand it. 
Yeah. I never could understand it. 16 years. You got people to put 16 years Speed in. Trap ahead. 30 Best years in. Safe. Yeah. You can't even enjoy. Speed you, trapping you either got feedback from what you've done on the job because you, your back messed up, your legs messed up, your head messed up, you done breathe in all this toxic stuff for these folks to make all these millions of dollars, but they ain't taking care of you. They don't care nothing about you. The love of Mimi have wax cold. Don't care nothing about you. Now we have a thing about staying at home now, and people still aren't getting a grip on what, you know, what have what the damage has been created. You know, you know, they tell you to stay home, and then you want to still mingle. You don't. They tell you to. They got the experts that are there that knows this stuff. He won't listen. Just won't listen. We got an hour and 33 minutes on the run. So hopefully this information impresses upon you. You know, those that are my viewers. And you can take it how you, lead, how you, how you want it. You know, because at the end of the day, we all in the same boat. We all got to leave this earth. And that's what people don't understand. It's like they're scared of leaving. But you gotta go. Regardless of what you think and how you think, you got to go. And the best thing you can do is enjoy your life, enjoy your kids, enjoy your, and try to create some happiness in your life. You know, Forget about what these folks think about you because that it means nothing. You know, people, you know, always presumptions, always assuming. I had, a, I'm looking on Facebook when I actually did uh, did the post, letting the person know that I got I got hacked, and they had the audacity to say that maybe maybe he was a mod stealer. I have no choice. I mean, I have, I can care less about mods, and the ones that actually are all into mods is the ones that are the biggest haters. You know, when they come down to against somebody stealing something, and I can care less about a mod because I'm in here, even though I got the mods in here, and there's only because that's what my viewers want. They don't want the unadulterated game because they it's too boring. You know, and it should never be too boring because this is where this is the direction that developers are going they don't have no mods in their games at all they allow us to play the game with mods that's a privilege that's not a that's not a you know they just did that because so they won't have to do a lot of the work you know but don't think that they ain't figuring it out I don't think they're not doing it <clears throat> you know just like um, and if you look at Euro Truck, Euro Truck is, is is more up to speed than ATS is. You know, but to get it to to catch up with ETS two, they have to slow things down for ETS because this is their bread and butter, and it's out of respect because this is the first, this is their first kid, it's the oldest kid. You know, so the. American Truck Simulator is is not sort not really the stepchild, but it is the little brother that has been caught up because I think uh, I'm not really don't quote me on this. I think we got maybe about four years, maybe three, four years on Air American Truck Simulator compared to 11, 12 years. With Euro Truck, I was playing Euro Truck when it first came out, when it was on it first, when it was the first, when it was the first version, and then they came out with two. When they came out with two, then that's when they started bringing out more trucks. They even had Scania uh, uh, driving simulator, which Speed gave you opportunity yeah. to use your shifter. You know, that was the technically the first, the 
the second actual uh, game where you only they only had you doing testing as you were driving along. You know, you had to go through these little uh, uh, test trials and things of that nature, but it gave you opportunity to, to use your shifter. And when they seen that that actually wet the whistle of their fans. Continue straight. Uh, then they actually came out with uh, Euro Truck 2. You know, and then they started uh, bringing out more trucks for that. Ooh, man, we about to lose it. I didn't got caught on that end. Continue I forgot straight. what I got in the back. All right, let me slow it down. <laughs> Glad I caught that. Normally I go over. And it's only because I can't see on that side. I might have to put that mirror up. I hate to put that mirror up, but that's how we, I got caught on that, that little um, divider right there. I wasn't supposed to be that close to that thing anyway, but you know, this thing is wider than what I expected. I really gotta watch the side now. I'm trying to stay on this edge right here because I know I turn, but the wheel back wheels are able to turn, so the low wheel follow the truck. Not a problem. This is the thing that a lot of people are not used to being challenged. So they figure, well, ATS is easier to drive. But drive that game is easier to drive, but all of it's the same. You know, all of it's the same. It's all about you just having to pay attention to what you're doing because if you was doing the special transport for. Uh, American Truck Simulator is pretty much the same, other than you're in tighter corners and you're dealing with uh, more unorthodox uh, uh, situations when it comes down to the trucks because you got cab overs and you have to be able to uh, read and maneuver um, with that. You got to go with the change. Yeah. So that's all that is. See, but technically all the trucks are driving the same thing. And that's a mod right there. That's not a uh, default trailer. And that was from Ghost Lord and uh, some other individuals that actually created it. Because that's mainly where I think that's where they started at in uh, Euro Continue Truck. Continue straight. So when you see their their mods in, uh, and they look more like Euro Truck because that's where they started at, and the trailers were created before uh, ATS actually came up with their own trailers. You know, so now they're stepping their game up in regards of um, American Truck Simulator, but. Uh, Modders still have a lot more work to do when it comes down to trying to keep up with ATS now. Because if you remember, yeah, yesteryears they had we had different trailers, and then they did the best they could when they created the trailers, and then they had to reformat them because they technically wasn't realistic. You know, so now you ain't got to even really deal with those trailers. Now you got more realistic, realistic trailers and they technically have to be based on the way the map is made because the way the map is is not speed trap really Let's made for safe. this for these long trailers they're just not made for them. like the trailer I'm pulling now is barely able to get through the road now the one that just drove past is the one that <clears throat> is technically not made for it either but it, it it will work because the back wheels actually turn so that actually helps and I think this is the doll trader I think no, I don't think this is a doll trader this is a paper trader 
But I do have some doll trailers in here. Some other doll Speed trailers. Speed trap ahead. Let's play this safe. Alright, we just made it to Dover. Not sure what Dover is. But I'm game to learn more and more about Euro Truck. And I learn every time I get in the game. I learn something new. And that's what life is. Life is based on learning something new. And if you're not game to learn something new, you want to always think that everything's supposed to be old, 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 but you don't understand. You only got a short time <clears throat> to learn what you can. Yeah, that's the Euro hauler, that's what it's called. Yep, I was scanning. I don't know what what truck that is right behind us. A few buses and things of that nature. So we're gonna be dropping this off. I'll try to, and it's kind of hard to even look. I have to look like this because you can't see on the side. Around them, take the second exit for freedom. But it's sort of neat that you can actually, and when you do the transport, you actually have escorts to help you along because a lot of stuff you can't see. You need to need help, which it was good that they created it. They just need to put more loads in here for that. And we can run lights, you know, because we're being escorted. So you ain't got to worry about uh, traffic, uh, traffic tickets when it comes down to that. I think we get to our destination, y'all. I think we're going to the port. So this load must be going on a ferry compared to if we were actually taking it uh, in Euro truck, I mean, not in Euro truck, in uh, American truck simulator. So. <sighs> and he's sleepy. I'm sleepy too. <laughs> so this was a long run, so to speak. But it had to be done. Don't get enough of this content in my channel and page, so it's only fair for me to do it. You've arrived. It's been my Ooh, honor and duty to see you through almost, this mission. Almost got messed up, so I guess this is it right here. So Alright, so I'm telling you, I might be on the wrong side, but oh well, doesn't matter. So hopefully you enjoyed it. If not, I mean, I did the best I could to help you enjoy it. Whatever. I mean, at the end of the day, I have to be confident, confident in what I do, even if I don't please everybody. So hopefully you all enjoyed the show. I'm going to drop this load off. And I would definitely catch you on the next video. And we didn't do too bad. Now, the bigger, the better. We got a progress achievement for that. Also, we did a good job. Even though we did bump the trailer a little bit. All right. Now, then continue. And go outside. So, we <sighs> so that all disappeared. I'm going to catch y'all on the next video. Part 242 up.